okay we have done this DC sweep simulation uh, how about circuit simulation okay um, of course um, we start from the simple circuit simulation we draw a schematic first um, why not we start something simple okay sinusoidal source resistor resistor and ground we start connecting them Okay, this is a very simple but complete circuit. We also want to add a probe, voltage probe here. Okay, to measure the uh, the voltage between between uh, uh, the voltage across this resistor, and um, of course um, the amplitude of this voltage source is one volt. Uh, frequency is one megahertz. And let's say we want to do transient simulation uh, one cycle. Okay. And let's say two cycle. Okay. Again, it asks us to. Uh, sorry. Uh, let's first save it. Uh, circuit circuit one okay let's try to run it okay instantly it is done uh, it's a very simple circuit so what we do is we just just want to see the voltage probe okay what's the voltage uh, how, how is the voltage changing uh, uh, with time so we just probe this uh, not surprisingly um, it's a sinusoidal wave uh, half half volt amplitude uh, as we see uh, the, the voltage the, the resistors are equal so uh, each resistor get half of the voltage which is half volt okay and the uh, frequency is 1 megahertz okay so this is a very simple uh, circuit no surprise seeing this um, how what will happen if we uh, do something more interesting we we draw another circuit diagram this time we want to have um, this semiconductor diode the diode we just have we have just simulated okay sorry I, I forgot one step sorry um, to do circuit simulation, we first need to define a circuit symbol. Okay, um, it has two pins, uh, so this is the default symbol for two pin devices. Uh, but it is not the what we want. What we need is actually a diode. So this is the diode. Okay, anode map to anode, cathode map to cathode. So we save the simulation again, and uh, now we can load it. We can load it into the schematic. As before, we uh, use a sign source, and uh, we put some uh, resistor over here. and connect them up So this is the circuit uh, 
and we recognize this is a uh, rectifier rectifier okay rectify schematic okay again we measure the uh, voltage across R2 uh, we again do trans transient simulation with two cycles okay and a run uh, of course this is a second run so run two okay the job is sub submitted and um, uh, if we are interested in the details we can look at the log messages okay it's displayed in this log window okay and uh, we can see that the results are shown here the, the, the solutions are shown here uh, um, the unit is picosecond so this is uh, roughly 400 picosecond 0 0.4, 0 0.4 microsecond half a cycle it will take a while um, but not at least we, we, we can uh, look at what we have now um, so we want to plot x and now we want to look at the positive voltage positive end of this R2 uh, no actually we had a probe so why don't we just look at the probe okay using time as the uh, variable okay so in the uh, we, we we our input is a sinusoidal but the rectifier cut off the negative half so we only see the positive half um this is, seems bright so far it hasn't complete yet um let's see whether it's completed yet yeah done it is done so we plot the same do the same plot again okay two cycles two half uh, two of the half waves okay so this is the um, so-called mixed mode simulation we have uh, only one numerical device sim device uh, component and um, the, the rest of the components are just a normal spice component okay spice component so this is the basic um, function functionality of, of this uh, Visual TCAT. Of course, um, we we apart from just running, we can also um, look at the previous simulation results. Okay, say run two. All the files are saved here. All the intermediate uh, results um, are saved here we can look at them one by one okay we can look at them one by one do some uh, interesting plot here and there okay so uh, that completes the demo okay there are many functionalities I like to show, and um, uh, but there isn't sufficient time. It is also not sufficient to look at the uh, uh, to look at the demo uh, to learn how to use it, uh, because many of the uh, key shortcuts and uh, the menu, the, the the mouse operations are not possibly demonstrated here. Uh, we will make further videos to uh, elaborate on the usage of this uh, fantastic software. Okay.